Hey guys, I hope you've been having a great week. I wanted to get on here real quick and do like a super fast video. Um, this is going to be a rave. And I talked about it in my last video briefly. The pomegranate face primer. It's mattifying, pore minimizing, and skin perfecting. It's the Corez. And I really, 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 if I hadn't said really enough, love it. Packaging claims that it's mattifying, pore minimizing, and skin perfecting. I definitely agree with all of those points. I have really oily skin. Usually within two hours of a makeup application, I'm having to blot away the oil or repowder. With the Corez as a face primer, it's probably four to five hours before I notice that there's any oil or anything. It's not shiny at all. It minimizes the pores on my nose and like my T-zone area to, I mean, even afterwards. It's not just while it's on, I've noticed that they're actually smaller when I clean my skin and stuff. But I really, really, really like it. If I didn't say really enough. It comes down, it's like this fair skin tone. Um, it goes on clear, it melts in with your own skin, and it just, I don't know, it goes to town. It For me, it feel like, feels like it moisturizes my skin in addition to like just evening out the skin tone and stuff like that. I really like it. Um, instantly when I put on my foundation, I noticed that I'm not having to even use as much foundation. I don't know if it, it says, like I said, skin perfecting, so I don't know if it helps fade the discoloration or what, but it really, when, it, when it's on the skin, I'm not having to use as much foundation. So I love that because I'm not having to wear as much makeup and I'm not having to go through foundation as fast, so that's awesome. It smells amazing. So I would say if you guys are in the market for a new primer or the good thing about Sephora, you can go and get a little sample. It's free and there's no limit. You can get a couple or you can keep going back. That's what I do with like perfumes and products, especially face products because I have super sensitive skin. So pretty much anything makes me break out. So what I'll do is I'll get a bunch of samples from Sephora beforehand, try it out. If it makes me break out, then I don't buy it. So I don't feel like I'm wasting any of my money. I love Sephora, so you can definitely go get a sample of this. I believe it is a little more expensive than their regular face primers. I just glanced at it real quick. I think they're normally $29. I think the pomegranate one is $32. I'm not 100% sure, but you can definitely check the Sephora website. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I also went and picked up the Nicki Minaj nail polish at Ulta, and I filmed a little like follow me around style video like um, haul in the car so I'm gonna insert that at the end if you guys think it's corny let me know in the comments I won't do it anymore but it was just you know that small of a haul I didn't think it was worth a whole video so I'm kind of combining these two videos one more thing because I'm sure I'll get some questions because you guys aren't used to see my hair curly it's always pinned straight for Christmas my fiance got me the Cortex 4-in-1 I believe it's called the Beliza Curling Iron. We ordered it from flatironexperts.com. It took forever to get here, but I know that, I mean, I live in the States and it was coming from Canada, so I expected that. I've been playing with it almost every day since I got it, and I love this thing. I use the one inch barrel, and then when I have my extensions in, I use the two inch barrel. I do a lot of that for work. But if you guys want to see like a video on how I curl my hair, definitely let me know in the comments below and I'll try to do a tutorial for you. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you soon. Bye. So I went to Ulta today and because I got their flyer and I saw all of the Nicki Minaj colors they were getting. So I called them this morning and they got them. And so I went there. I picked up, um, so I've really been wanting to try out the Zoya Nail Polish Remover a little haul video for you guys and then I got the Nicki Minaj colors so this is fly this is pink Friday which of course I couldn't wait and I'm wearing now Let's see. oh of course I'm filming my finger sorry um this one is metallic for life and I really really like this chunky glitter. It's like black though. It's really pretty. And where is it? Oh, this one I have on my glitter nail right now. It's Save Me. And it's so pretty. I love the tinsel in it. The blue tinsel. So pretty. But while I was there, I also saw Zoya's new spring line. And this color 
is really, really pretty. It's like a very pale purpley gray. But the color, if it'll zoom, come on. The color is Megan. So, of course, I had to get that, even though it's spelled wrong because it's supposed to be M E A G A N, but whatever. Still a very pretty color. Like I said, it looks like a whited out gray, but purple. So, we shall see how that looks. But then, what I'm pissed about is because I got home, and what did I find? 20% off your entire purchase at Ulta. But it doesn't start until January 22nd. So, I guess that's an excuse to go shopping again, huh? See, they get me with these. I go, they release something that I want, and then they send these out and make me spend more money. So, and that's, she's like laughing at me right now. Ha, ha, ha. Glasses popping. And the glasses cool.